Back to throw as Wilson throws. Touchdown! Throws it back to Young. Young catches the ball! They might! They do score! Throws it! Touchdown! Bounces out of the pocket. Waiting, waiting. Here's the pass. Touchdown! Most people think I chose BYU because I was a Mormon kid, and the truth was is that I chose BYU because of the football team. You know, in those days, frankly, not a lot of teams threw the ball. I mean, the powerhouse teams all ran that wishbone offense, and so it was pretty exciting to think about coming here and, and getting a chance to throw it 35 or 40 times a game. And the more I learned about the passing game and, and football in general, especially what we did here, it got so fun. Uh, because once you learned the system and got efficient in the system, you, you really felt like nobody could stop you. And that was just intoxicating. And I just fell in love with it. We came back from Oregon State. Uh, found, I found out perhaps uh, you know, Monday that he was hurt badly and he was gone for the season. Uh, I was so nervous about being the starting quarterback. Couldn't sleep, couldn't eat. Uh, Doug Scoville was the offensive coordinator. He called me in and, and on, on his desk he put our playbook with a bunch of sticky tabs and said, I want you to go through all the pages of the plays and I want you to put a sticky tab on every play that you like. And all the tabs that I put the sticky tabs to were rollout plays. And so he saw that and he said, what's with all these rollout plays? Which we've never run, by the way. And I said, well, I, as a kid, I grew up playing on the street, two men touching the street, and I'm a lot more comfortable actually running around. And so we put in all these rollout plays. And then the other interesting twist was that I could throw a better running to my left than to my right, which made no sense. And so most of all the running, the rollout plays were to the left. And so there was no way Colorado State ever imagined that we would roll out, much less roll out to the quarterback's, you know, left-hand side. And so this, you know, the same play kept worked time and time again. In fact, the, I remember, still remember the name of the play. It was I right, sprint left, 55 max, and it worked every time. And uh, we threw these seven touchdown passes, which was crazy. No doubt one of the highlights was the, uh, University of Utah game my sophomore season and uh, we, we moved the ball but we couldn't score but finally in the fourth quarter we scored a few times and kind of put the game away and I came out of the game and then someone realized that I had thrown for about 560 some yards which was five or six yards shy of the national NCAA single game passing record so they actually put me back in the game and, and we were just trying to get six yards because we just wanted to break the record we didn't want to score <laughs> But uh, it didn't work out that way, so finally it was like third and ten, and I threw a ball and went into the end zone. We scored a touchdown and broke the record, and the University of Utah has been mad at us for 30 years because in their minds we ran up the score. That was, uh, yeah, that was a great memory, actually. There haven't been too many guys that have held that record over the, all these years, you know, so to, to be one of the people that have held that uh, single-game passing record is, is kind of a fun thing to think about.